Hi everyone, in today's quick tip video for Embrilliance Essentials, I'm going to show you how you can zoom in to get a better view of a design or text or something that you've got on your screen within your hoop. So the first thing I want to just say before I go any further is just come up to the top of your page when you're in Embrilliance Essentials and come to view and just make sure that you've got the same settings selected as I've got here and under manage views make sure you've got the same objects selected as I've got selected here. That way you'll know that hopefully you're looking at the same screen that I'm looking at here in my Embrilliance Essentials. So I've just opened up Embrilliance Essentials with a new blank page. I use PES format and the default hoop size that I have set in my settings is my 8 by 12 and I have got another video showing how to do that so if you go to the Embrilliance Essentials playlist you'll be able to go and refer to that if you don't know how to do it. So I'm just going to come up to this um, design library icon here and I'm going to select it and I'm just going to come into here and choose one of the designs. So I'll choose this kind of um, Christmas bauble shape design and I'm going to say OK and that's just put that on my mat. Now you can see over here there's a slider bar with a plus and a minus so this basically alters the view of your hoop so if I bring this slider down it makes the hoop on my mat smaller and if I make if I slide it up the bigger I slide it the bigger um, the zoom comes in on the screen but if I just go back to zoom and hoop just so it comes back to the hoop size sometimes you want to zoom in on a particular part of the design so let's say I just want to have a look at this circle section on the top what I can also do is above where you've got the plus and the minus slider bar you'll see this north south west and east kind of compass design if I left click on that it opens up this window and at the moment you can see there's a crosshair in the middle and that crosshair is homed in on the center of the hoop now if I left click and drag that up to the circle and let go when I zoom in now it will zoom in on that area it fixes on that area so I can get really, really, really close in and I can have a look at how this is going to stitch out. Now, if you want to just go quickly back to Zoom to Hoop, left click on the little red dot and then you can go Zoom and Hoop and it will drop you back to the hoop. If I don't use this compass um, design here and use this, this will just bring the zoom in from the center of the hoop as I'm sliding up and you can see that I'm not where I want to be and I have to kind of use my mouse or you know try and see if I can drag this down so the easiest way I say to do it is to use the compass take the crosshair to where you want to look and then zoom in and it will just home in on that area for you. So that's today's quick tip video on how to use the zoom and once you've finished left click on the red dot and it closes the window down. Please give the video a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe if you don't already do so and I'll see you in the next video.